Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies, this is Srinivas. In this video, I am going to explain how to add all the elements in the array. Just we are adding the elements which are present in the array from first location to last location. A simple logic and we are using a for loop to process the elements. Here program execution starts with the main function, main we are taking one array, any size we are taking, for example, size is a 6 and we can initialize the array directly in this way, for example, 3, 7, 1, 4, 6, 8, 5 elements we are taking, 5 elements. Now we need to add all these elements, finally, we should display the sum. So here, we are declaring one variable sum and initial value is a 0. Sir, for example, if you are not initializing with 0, what will happen? So, if you are not initializing with 0, that local variable value, default value is a garbage value. So, whenever we are adding the elements, the elements will be added to garbage value. Finally, the output is a another garbage value. So, that is the reason, initially we are, we are initializing sum value with a 0, sum equal to 0. And now, to repeat, to process the loop, here it is we are declaring one variable. So, we are repeating the for loop, for i value index starts with a 0 and here it is up to size, is nothing but less than size, directly here we are mentioning that size is a 6 and next one is a i plus plus i equal to 0, i is less than 6, i plus plus. So, 6 times it will repeat. When i equal to 0, the control come inside. Here it is a of 0, that element is a 3. The 3 we are adding to sum. The 3 we are adding to sum. How? Here it is a of 0th location element, nothing but a of i. We are adding to, adding to that variable sum. What is that sum value 0? To this 0, we are adding 3 and the result we are storing into sum again, sum. Here it is a 0 plus 3. So, sum value become 3, become 3 and next one. Here it is i value increase, i value become 1. A of 1 means what? The value is a 7, that 7 will be added to sum. Already sum value is a 3, 3 plus 7 the value will go and store into this sum, value become 10. In the next iteration, value means what? A value become 2, that second location element is a 1. So, 10 plus 1, value become 11. It will continue, 11 plus 4, value is a 15. Next one, 15 plus 6, value become 21. Next one, 21 plus 8, value become 29. So, that is the final sum after adding the elements 3, 7, 1, 4, 6, 8. Once the for loop execution completed, after 6 iterations, next i value becomes 6. 6 is less than 6, condition false. Then that loop gets terminated, it will come out and we are printing that sum value. Sum percentage d, here it is, that sum value we are displaying sum, it will give the output is what? 29. So, this is the simple logic, just how to find out sum of all the array elements. Hope you understood. For more videos, please subscribe to Narayshati channel. Thank you.